much my friends. Uh, so alligator gar bow hunting. <laughs> Time to cross into the other side. Time to get in the Smokies. It'll be fun. Let's do it. for the first time in a while. I kind of like it. I don't know, I just find it really peaceful walking out in the rain. The only downside is that there is like lightning and thunder happening up on one of those ridge lines. <laughs> Might hunker down at this tent site for a little bit and then push on the last 3.7 miles. Dude, I just got destroyed. Ironically, just after I was talking to you about, you know, enjoying the rain, nature, or well, the Smokies particularly, came and taught me a big lesson about what rain can be like. But I've never been in anything like that. Before the time I could even set up my tent, the floor was filled with water. And um, I was trying to get the stakes in the ground, but the ground had too many rocks underneath the thin layer of dirt. So I was just went good. And I just picked up my whole tent, all the poles, everything in my bag. And I just like, like get that out of the way, get that out of the way. I'm putting a tent here. There were like streams forming around around me fortunately i've checked it everything's dry but i'm glad i've got the trash bag liner in the bottom um because if it was a cold tonight you know like i'd be in a lot of trouble man crazy experience day one in the smokies first few hours in the smokies dude i'm so pumped right now i'm just <laughs> Oh, after that rain, that's exactly, that's why I'm out here. It's like for moments like that, I just, it's just like this whole trip, this whole experience, the trail, everything just grabbing you by the neck and just shaking you and like yelling at you going, you are alive. Even though I'm wet, I'm soaking, I'm dirty. Like my, even worse, my shorts have split. But like, I'm so happy. If a moment like that doesn't make you excited to be out here, if instead you go, I'm miserable, I'm wet, my tent is wet, then like, maybe don't do it. Anyway, love and life, wet as a dog, dirty as hell, day one in the Smokies, but let's keep going. Seven or seven PM. Uh, probably more on the low side of things right now. The same problem I had a while ago in my right leg. Fontana, I picked up the same thing in my left, and like today, it's just aggravating me. So, as I've been coming up the mountain, it's taken me a while to do the last couple of miles, and like every step is painful. But again, this is like what I was saying before: is like this is what you sign up for. You're in it for these good parts and these bad parts, and um, but. Ideally you wouldn't have it, you know, I, but you know, I'm dealing with it and I'm gonna get to the shelter, I'm gonna work on it, have a hot dinner, and try and get dry. So, gotta love it. <laughs> hey, day 
two in the Smokies and the plan is 12 miles. It's rainy this morning but the weather is due to clear up and my leg was really troubling, troubling me last night. See how far I can make it before it starts to bother me again. trouble finishing the last four miles this thing just keeps tightening up on me at the end of every day man I'm gonna do this slowly throughout the day and then in those last four miles or you know I just it's agony every step I gotta I just gotta do it that's what I'm in for so Sail. 